What's up, boys? What's up, people? It's a beautiful morning. Beautiful morning. It's freezing, <laughs> though. Get your walks in. Um, yesterday, we was coming back from gym, and we were having a conversation after leg day. And um, during, like, your self-improvement journey or whatever, like, purpose you have, <clears throat> um, there's two sort of sides to it, and that's ambition and the guilt that you feel. Um, and, uh, go on. What was it? What was it? The guilt. Yeah. So Ways. Like, yeah, it's almost like um, it's a sort of comment on the action you take, right? So like you can get quite self-involved about um, just the habit side of it and just making sure that you do X, Y, and Z every single day. So you're going to the gym every day, whether you've got a business on the side and you, you know, you have a time set out in the morning of like a deep work period, for example, where you want to get done every day. You can get quite zoned in on just making sure like they ticked off a chick the ticked off a checklist. Um, but what eventually you start to realise is that it's it's not just that. It's um it's more that when you don't do it, you get this pretty strong element of guilt that you feel. Um, and I think the point was that a lot of people probably don't have that. Um, that's sort of an element of your personality that sort of gets gets developed as you go along self-improvement. Yeah. Um, so like a lot of people will probably just sit there and eat a load of shit for a night or spend hours on video games or watching porn or some yeah. random shit and that'd be normal to them so they wouldn't feel any guilt. Um, but the second you start making progress um, and putting steps in and redoing the shit every single day and living it, um, you start to realise that you're in a completely different path and when you don't do it, you get this guilt. Um, and it's really that, it's really that that pushes you forward. That is what, yeah, that's what a lot of people don't have. So that strong guilt feeling that you get, if you get that, I feel like that's, um, it's going to help you a lot in your, your fitness journey or whatever you're pursuing. But yeah, you obviously have ambitions and that, which is all good because yeah. um, that's, that's obviously what you want to achieve. But then, yeah, like Anton just said, the guilt that you feel when you do fuck about and and you don't you don't do what you're supposed to be doing, such as hitting the gym and stuff like that, that is what will that is what will change you. So as long as you feel that guilt, then uh, you're good. I'd then say, you're all I'd good. Say you're good. We had a leg session yesterday, yeah. um, and and he had college, so we cut it off just before we did leg press yeah. and uh, leg extensions. I went back home. He went to uni. I did a little bit of work for a bit. I had a meal, and I thought, nah. It was a feeling inside and then um can't really be having that. He came and picked me up and then we were sat in the car and he goes, Should we finish off a leg session? Bearing in mind it's it's late already at this point, it's like ten PM. Yeah, ten eleven PM. And then we went back, I started editing some of the video that was uploaded yesterday and then uh, got a meal in and then we went to the gym at like eleven, hit finish off our leg session. Mm. Literally did two exercises, did leg press and then uh, leg extensions to burn out and um literally just went there 30 minutes in and out dirty yeah it's got to be done though purely because of that guilt it feeling does. inside it does had to be hit it's true but like two two things it's like um even if in the moment you might be in the gym you might your legs might be killing bruv or you might be thinking oh extenuating circumstances like let's give it a rest it's fine um you get home and later you start to clock you start you start to feel this shit yeah. and then, then you'll realize that I'd, I'd say confidently that at that point, you're not average, bruv. Yeah, you're You not. haven't really succumbed to like the weaknesses that society tries to like put on you. You know, you, you've, yeah. got, you've got your goals, you've got your ambition. You're going places. <coughs> you are going places. True say. Yeah, just a little... It's a pretty important factor, I'd say. Just a little morning thought for you lot right there. 